Today I'm collaborating with Taylor Sharp from Simply the Sharps. I'll have her link in the description box below. But I'm really excited to just connect with other mamas and especially ones that are on YouTube because they kind of understand how difficult it is and how challenging it can be but also how rewarding it can be. So she's also doing a clean with me video on her channel today and we are just collaborating to hopefully um, help expose you guys to some more mamas that are kind of like on the same journey as us. So definitely go and check out her channel and if you are from Taylor's channel thanks for coming. I hope you hit the subscribe button and um, stick around for some extra videos soon. So morning guys today is going to be a clean like deep clean and pack with me because we are getting ready to move everything next week which is crazy to me i'm a little bit nervous about it but i have been filming part of the packing process for the last week and a half because i started i don't know a couple weeks ago i guess but there's so much and i really just had a lot of footage and just really didn't know what to do with it so you you, you guys are just gonna have to miss out on some of the packing i had the kitchen clean and then we did breakfast this morning <clears throat> so we're gonna have to clean that up first i'm gonna have to make a run to the grocery store for a couple of things as well as diapers some magic erasers and i also was going to try to find some bubble wrap which i hate to use but some of the mirrors that i need to pack up need need bubble wrap so they don't they don't get broke so everything is empty pretty much our living room is empty we've got a lot of things packed up that were like decor that we're just not using at the moment all of our furniture is gone for the most part except for our beds and then a couple things in micah's room so we're just going to be putting away some things today <laughs> that kid is always naked we're going to be putting away some things today and just trying to go through and like clean up where sayla has drawn on things clean the windows just a last deep clean before we move also i don't know um, i'll probably try to take you guys on on this trip today but we meet with our builder for on the land that we are thinking about purchasing so i'll take you guys there and let you guys see that i don't know if we'll end up purchasing it or not but at least you guys can get an idea so anyways let's go ahead and get this day started i've been here before but i have to stay afloat it's not easy be a person you don't want can somebody take me other thing going to do going to do where is the life i where's my shy head is this calling Just finished cleaning up the kitchen it's not like 100 i'll get to that later but we've got to go to the store i just used micah's last diaper as when he woke up this morning and i'm pretty sure he's pooped so we gotta get some more diapers and also um that clean spot in the living room is no longer clean like it lasts overnight just because they're asleep that is what happens when you are a mom and you have kids so i think i'm going to when we move i'm just going to keep two bins of toys for the kids to play with and then everything else is going in storage and then we might like i don't know if if they don't miss them we might just get rid of them all together we'll see let's go to the store and get this stuff Come on. 
we just got home and the guy that's supposed to be spraying our house apparently decided to take a nap in our driveway so came home to that also came home to a box from amazon which i'm really excited about so i'm going to do a video about this later but this is all going to be about like my fitness journey that I'm taking I'm gonna do a competition again I've talked about that in a previous video but I'm gonna like tell you guys everything that I'm doing so I got this cryo cold pack and it's supposed to help you burn fat again I'll talk about it in another video this derma roller set came with a vitamin C serum so I'm excited about that and then also got party supplies for Micah's birthday which we are doing in a dinosaur theme so I hate getting more stuff especially when I'm getting ready to move and it's like comes time to move it all but it was just some stuff that I wanted to go ahead and get so that I could start using it but, so I just laid Micah down for his nap I guess um, what I'm gonna do is take the magic erasers that I just bought and go around the house and just try to clean up spots that Sayla has drawn on so that we don't have any issues with the buyer when we decide to sell the house. I know you feel like you want me And I guess in a way you do All of my breath on reveling emotions I need some space to think this through Call me on alone. Try to give you hints and a heart to see. Right on the line, no. Losing it on you is the last thing I need. If I'm honest, I'll just make you cry. And I don't wanna fight with you. I just finished cleaning off all the marks. I think I got them all. So I'm, I get so overwhelmed when it comes to cleaning and especially now that I'm having to pack too. So right now I'm just gonna focus on our master bathroom. I'm gonna pack away things that we definitely don't need to use and then try to put things in a box that we are gonna keep. We'll see how it goes. But I'm gonna turn on some good music and just let you guys watch me clean. If you feel my mind, Call me on alone Try to give you hints and a heart to see Right on the line, no Losing it on you is the last thing I need If I'm honest, I'll just make you cry And I don't wanna fight with you boxed up everything that we are going to need in the next few weeks months in here and then there's some other stuff underneath the cabinets so the other stuff like so a few decor pieces um, and then a few other things that I know we won't need in the next few weeks 
I have put in another box but honestly I need to like go through it and just make sure that I want to keep it in our new house that part is gonna be really hard the whole minimalism thing that that part is very hard for me because I'm a person that's like well I might need this in the future but I hate holding on to stuff now so I am starving it's only 10 30 in the morning I only had a protein shake and a pancake for breakfast we were out of eggs so I think I'm gonna go take a lunch break even though it's not lunchtime and then uh, pick back up can't say that I really want to do this this video because I don't really want to clean I don't really want to pack but it's got to be done and hopefully what this will give you guys some motivation too so really you ain't gonna hit me back yeah now it's all just you got me on blast down you're over it i've been done we're so toxic can't get enough oh i'll go and say it like a mantra you know what you want do ya? oh hell no i won't play the monster no matter what you tell yourself I should have known that we could, we could never be friends. I'm on my knees. <laughs> you guys are on a tripod and I don't feel like raising it up. And if I hold the camera, then you're gonna hear that clicking noise. Still haven't found my microphone fuzzy thing. Maybe I'll find it as I'm packing. Anyways, kids are outside, out back on the back porch playing. So I'm having to like run in and out to make sure that they are okay. Um, I'm in Micah's room right now. I have about an hour before it's their nap time. So I want to try to get as much packed up in here as I can. So let's do this. Don't tell your friends we're so done. It never ends. You have a fun. Oh, I'll go and say it like a mantra. You know what you want, do ya? Talking for an hour, we just can't find the end. We won't understand each other. I wonder how it feels to fall asleep and love the one that's next to me. I don't know why I'm stuck around with you. I've been told I should go find myself again. You're taking my soul, everything I own, poison in my head. We fall down the more we keep trying, leaving us with scars. To be alone, we had our times, but now I know that they are gone. Wonder how it feels to fall asleep and love the one that's next to me. I don't know why I'm stuck around with you. I just got the kids down for a nap. I finished Micah's room. Sayla's room is, I did it yesterday. Kitchen is 
tidied up. I need to sweep and mop, but they've made a mess in the living room, which is typically what happens while I'm cleaning. They are making a mess somewhere else. My hip is really bothering me today, which is frustrating because I feel like it was doing so good and was absolutely no pain for a long time. And then now it's starting to like inflame, flame back up flare back up that's the word it's really kind of a struggle right now to have the motivation to finish this up but going to um but i wanted to show you guys i drew this out this is our house plans hopefully i drew it there's probably gonna have to be some type of change because i'm not an architect although i do think that would be a fun job so I'll show you guys also i found this a-frame house and i've fallen in love with it it's called the black a-frame and you can find them on pinterest too i think it's airbnb actually so i don't know if you guys can see that how pretty that is Hold on. isn't that gorgeous so that's technically not a tiny house but i love the style of that house like how the a-frame is one part and then the rest of it is not a-framed so with that in mind i've tried to like lay out a floor plan for us. I'm gonna show it to our builder today and see what he thinks, but. So let's see, let's turn it this way. Sayla has drawn all over this and I drew a bigger, better version of this, which I may need to redo. I cannot find it. Um, so thankfully I could have, I have this one, but anyways, so this, this part right here will be the A frame and you'll come into the house on the side, which I have some ideas of how to make it look symmetrical, but Anyways, this will be the living and kitchen area. So the living room here, a small round dining table, um, and then a kitchen right here. And then over here, which will be um, like eight or nine foot ceilings, we're gonna have bedroom one, which is the master bedroom. Um, I had to make some changes on this closet. And then bedroom two with the kids closet, the kids will be sharing. This will be a little hallway and you'll walk into the bathroom or the bedrooms. Um, the bathroom will be washer dryer, shower, toilet, sink, and then like a little shelf right there for storage. And then I'm also thinking about having a door go out the master bedroom to the back porch or back deck and then same thing out of the kitchen. So anyways, that's kind of what I am like contemplating right now. I need to talk to our builder and just see if that's possible um, because it's still going to be about 650 square feet. I don't even know if that layout is a good idea, bad idea. I don't know. Anyways, I thought that other one was so pretty. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to clean up the mess that they made and then I'm going to go out and uh, meet our builder as soon as the kids wake up from their nap. questions like over there is like a trench <laughs> you guys can see it. i can't walk because there's so many thorns and i have shorts on but we're going to get some questions answered about that and then if they come out okay then we're going to go ahead and oh look there's a blackberry go ahead and make an offer is it good Taylor? oh we can't <laughs> camera shy, shy. Today. So there's lots of blackberry patches on here. And if we build, we would build back there towards the tree line and have animals and like, there's no other houses back here. It's awesome. So hopefully this is the one. Spray 
Say it. Say it. Let's stop. Ready, buddy. Ready. Yes. Oh. <laughs> I think in the next few days he's gonna be taking ten steps or more. Cause he just uh-uh, Sailor, quit spraying him now. Sailor, Stop. Give me, give me the bottle. Release. Break it. And now he's going for the dog to All right, you guys. I'm gonna call it a day. We're home, getting ready to eat supper. I've got to finish editing this video, so I'm going to end the video here. But don't forget to go and check out Taylor's channel. She is a mama of two, and she uploads some pretty awesome videos. She also is into minimalism, too, so if you are beginning to wander into that like I am, then you'll definitely find some inspiration there. So, hope you guys have a great day. I'll see you guys in the next video. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and leave me a comment down below. See you guys later. Bye.